What to do before an earthquake. You must have available a first aid kit, a whistle, dynamo flashlights, radio with batteries, bottled water and non-perishable food, and a fire extinguisher. Talk, plan, and practice with your family. Do simulations and talk to your family about what to do in case of an earthquake. Have always identified the safe areas and emergency exits in your home, school, or workplace. Know how to turn off the water, gas, and electricity. Check the electrical sockets. Know the emergency phone numbers, ambulances, police, and firefighters. Attach objects securely so that they won't cause damage. Do not place heavy objects in high places. What to do during an earthquake. Drop, cover, hold on. Calm down. Try to stay as calm as possible. If you're inside, stay away from furniture, windows, and lamps. If you're outside, stay away from buildings, walls, and power poles. If you are driving, stop in a safe place. Turn on the hazard lights and stay inside the vehicle. If you use a wheelchair, put the brakes on in a safe place and protect your head with your arms. If you are in a crowded place, protect your head with your arms or take cover under the seats and tables. What to do after an earthquake. Turn off water, electricity, and gas. Use the stairs. Do not use elevators. Put out any fire. And for a light source, use flashlights. Do not enter damaged buildings. If you are trapped, cover your mouth and nose. Don't shout because you can suffocate in the dust. Hit the object to show your position. Injured people. Do not move seriously injured people unless they are in immediate danger of being harmed. Be alert to the possible aftershocks that might occur. Do not use the phone unless absolutely necessary. Pay attention only to information from the authorities. Earthquakes with less magnitude occur more each year than earthquakes with greater magnitudes. Earthquakes also occur from sudden movements of tectonic plates. Effects are shaking ground, ground rupture, landslides, and tsunamis.